When I was in second grade, there was this kid in fourth grade named Gary who always bullied me before school and at lunchtime recess. And nope, it wasn't Gary Oak like some of you little lobsters might be thinking. He'd call me names and act like a general nuisance anytime I tried playing on the playground. It got to the point where I'd avoid him by taking alternate routes to my destination. For some reason, I've had to deal with bullies a lot, and I don't understand why. Like when I was in 6th grade, this other 4th grader was making fun of me and tried hitting me, so I grabbed him and bit him. Man, I hate 4th graders. If you're in 4th grade, we can't be friends. I'm sorry, we just can't. Not yet. Just, just grow up and fly right and see me when you're at least 12. Or at most 9. If you're 10 or 11, I don't want to hear from you. For the rest of this story to make sense, I have to tell you about my eating disorder. For as long as I can remember, I had this disorder which causes the food I eat to involuntarily come back into my mouth, so I have to either throw up or swallow it again and again until it stays down. One morning, I saw Gary near the swings, and my mouth had just filled up with the scrambled eggs and toast I had for breakfast. So I walked up to Gary and puked in his face instead of swallowing it. It was a bit extreme, but it had to be done. I just casually walked away, and he never picked on me again. If I'm using an eating disorder to fend off bullies, that's pretty much a superpower, right? If you agree, hit the like and subscribe buttons. You can also follow me on Twitter at GiantLobsterBot. Thanks for watching, unless you're a fourth grader.